treats you. Oh, Jesus. I'm going to treat you like my own personal jungle gym. I, I didn't need that description. Hello, Shri, and welcome back to the Chan Chan Gang Gang. We are watching The Kissing Booth 2. I hate myself more than I realized, apparently. We're learning something new every day. I hate myself more when I just saw the running time for the film and it's two hours and 12 minutes. Two hours longer than it needs to be. If you haven't already seen my reaction to the first Kissing Booth movie, I will link that down below or tag it here. If you'd like to, please don't forget to subscribe, it'd mean the world to me. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, that's fine. I was gonna force you to like it because we still have our free will for now. Let's just get this over with. Yeah. Do -do. Please don't be as bad as the first one, or that's probably gonna be even worse. Why did they make another one? They could have left it where it was. It doesn't need a follow up, let alone a third film. Oh, we're getting a full Come movie recap. Lucky us. Watch Noah sleep. Edward, that you? Watch I wonder if this was awkward for them to film because they broke up before this started filming, didn't they? Oh no. Everyone has a podcast these days. Maybe I'll start one. Applied for a passport? That's so weird. I feel like everyone in European countries just has a passport as it is. They still have rules. Is her hair a wig? It looks like a wig. And a bad one. I'm sorry if that's really her hair. Maybe she does actually have a wig on because she shaved her head for the act, the TV show on Hulu or Stars Play, whatever it is. So I think I'm right. I think that's a wig. It is based on some books. Don't know whether that makes this even worse then that someone wrote this and thought it was a good idea. Okay, their friendship's off to a good start. Will they get in an argument this time? Man, his laugh is just next level weird. Why is she British? Hello? <laughs> They're like a kissing booth. Is it Noah? Oh, it's... No, it's gonna be Noah. Cause Noah's always been controlling. Oh, I can't believe there's two hours left. I'm just gonna end it all. Say nay. Nay. He's so quirky and cool and different. So you big man on campus yet? <laughs> you know, not exactly. It's kind of different here. Well. He's being bullied. No one likes him. He has no friends. It's okay to be homesick. I am. I'm fine. I'm. I'm oh, he's homesick. I think he has no friends. Like when did he become like a kind of decent person? His character just took a 180 between these two movies. Help but think about rule number 19. Oh, the rules, please drop them. Oh, that's so stupid. You're gonna have to move on at some point. Oh, Lee's gonna have a breakdown again, isn't he? I can't handle this. You really need to wow them with your personal essay. She'll be like, the kissing booth meant something to people. <laughs> There's still two hours left. I don't understand how, but that's a pos- I just- eh. And the two other kids on their dance machine. It's being taken down. <gasps> oh, no, someone's beat them. Oh my god, these two need to grow up. Oh, why does this kind of seem ominous? Like, there's gonna be a murder. Oh, of course. Oh, is he actually gonna swing into action this time instead of just standing by and saying no? Wow, he's actually being a sort of all right friend. He's really going for it. Don't break your ankles. Oh, he's Tom Cruise now, apparently. But I mean, A for effort. He's really coming out here for L this time. Oh, he's gonna fall into the cake. That's why they showed us the cake. Also, what kind of professional video is this of this guy working out? Like, he just goes to their school. Why is there such production value on it? Haha, <laughs> never saw that coming. Watch him be better than Noah in all ways, shapes, and form. Like, he's actually a decent guy, and then she's gonna end up with Noah still, though. Also, why was someone filming this guy Marco's butt? Investigation, please. Is it the weirdo from last time? It's Byron again! Yay! He's getting more screen time. Marco's there. Why do they have more chemistry than Noah and Elle in the first film? Like, the whole film? I like him. Damn it. It's just not funny. With your name on it, from Boston. Noah. What? Oh my gosh. 
Oh, oh, don't be something weird. Don't be something weird. Be something wholesome. Oh my god. Oh. I'm still so confused as to why he's taken such a 180 as a character. He was such a dick in the last film. And now they've completely just switched him up. She's in the originals. Love that. Alright, bye. I can't wait to meet. Okay, he's back to the kind of like the Noah we know. He dipped real quick, but I mean, it's fine. He has plans. Good luck, Captain Evans. We're fine. We're good. On your marks. Get set. Oh, she's on time. See, chemistry. Let's go! Did I actually just fall for that? Oh, and they did the whole internal, like, speech again. We know you fell for it. Please don't explain it to me. See? Is he going to let her win? He's going to give her a hand. No, he is gonna give her a hand. Oh, he won. Okay, I thought it'd be unrealistic. Oh, that's ugly. Is that Marco? Oh, he's a singer too. I think he's clearly the superior choice, though. Like, not lying. What does Noah have? Anger issues, control issues. I don't know what else. He doesn't really have much going for Noah. I will applaud that. I'm a fan of Marco. They were beaten again. Is MVP his girlfriend? It might be. Or Marco. It's Marco. How much money do they have? Because this starts to add up. Yay! But they're going to get beaten again. Like Marco's going to walk in or something. It's either Marco or his girlfriend. Oh, and then she can go to Harvard. It's her ticket. That's not fair that that school's cost that much. Like, that's so much money. And what what are you getting out of it? Like, where is that money going? I'm glad you're making friends out there. And yeah, me too, because I thought I you to were lonely. You and Do you think that you're maybe just taking this, like, a little bit too seriously? It's 50000 It is serious. I'll make a deal. Oh, what's the deal? I'll, you win. I do the booth. She'll do the dance one, but win. he's... That's how we realize that he's MVP. Free. Okay. Little does she know, he's also a dancer. He's MVP. This is gonna be interesting to see. No, he's got this. Wonder who MVP is. Mm hmm. What's your middle name? <laughs> oh, they're stupid. It's like dancing for her life here now. Wow, I've never seen such high stakes. Oh, she won. I was like, we don't have time for her to babysit his sister. You can leave the guitar at home. <laughs> I don't get that burn. Oh, he stood up. No, poor Rachel. Oh, she deserves better. I told you the brothers are trash. Oh, she's going to think back to when Noah left and didn't turn around. <laughs> yeah, loved that. When did, once again, when did he become so wholesome? He just hit the man on the back with the cardboard. <laughs> I still wonder if this was awkward at all for them. Possibly. Is it a fake ID? It's a fake ID. Yeah, because she's still in school. Right, so he's 21 and she's hopefully 18, right? Please tell me that's the case. Or that they both had fake IDs. I'm going to treat you like my own personal jungle gym. I, I didn't need that description. I just kind of want to... Chuck. Yeah, uh, E. Oh Lord! I love this city. He's like, I love you. I love this girl. Okay, the candle lights are on. Not in front of the Hollywood sign this time. I see they've moved on. Why is this such a plot line though? Like, I get it, she's hot, but would you really be worried? Oh, she like, oh, she didn't say hi to me. Like a little rude. I keep him around. Oh, oh, what does that mean? Oh, Noah's feeling a bit uncomfy about that. Oh, oh, T. Is there actually a reason for her to be worried? 
she is giving me weird vibes. I don't know. Is is, is she being wholesome here? Is her our intentions pure? Or have her and Noah had a thing? Possibly. I'm now starting to believe they could have. Oh, there's something under the bed. What's under the bed? Clothing. Pendant. An earring. Ooh. Drama. Ooh. Ooh. I can't tell if he's cheated or not. It kind of looks like he has. Oh. Is she reading into it or did it happen? I think it might have happened. I told you. Marco Superior. Um, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I preferred the first film. This one feels very slow and it's making me want to like just end it all immediately. Oh, I told you Chloe's just a friend. How did you know I meant her? That's true. How did he know? But I guess maybe it's like one of his only girlfriends around there. Then I believe you. I don't believe you, Noah. He didn't say nothing happened. He just said good. So something did happen. He was being too wholesome for a reason. Uh, what is this? You What's going on here, though? I'm hoping they are just friends. I think you're good for me. Mm. Tell me something I don't know. Uh, is that flirting? I think it was flirting. <laughs> oh, please stop the, the fake laughing. It's so bad. Oh, no. He injured his ankle before the dance competition. She's going to have to dance with Marco. He's going to have to become a partner. Marco's gonna step Wait, actually, in. You know He's like, yeah, you could ask Marco. Me. Marco. No, no. This is how it started with Noah before, and look how that worked out. Not entirely great, but I think Marco's a better option. I'm gonna speak it into existence. Choose Marco. That's the way you wanna do it. They still have more chemistry than her and Noah ever had, or ever will. But they're still gonna choose Noah in the end. Just why? Like, there's no point in me getting attached to Marco because he's not gonna stick around, is he? I've never told you this before, but uh, I love you. I love you, Rachel. Oh, that's wholesome stuff. And I'm really hoping that you love me too. Is she gonna get up, or is she gonna be like mad at him for doing this over the speaker? Is she gonna text him now? Please don't be a poop emoji. It's funny face that everyone's waiting to see. Let's go. No one saw. Okay. What was it? I actually yeah. didn't know. Oh, he got a smiley face. Yay. She's calling Noah. Of course he's at the gym. Where else would he be? With Chloe? Okay, what'd you find? Watch him try and convince like, oh, it's your earring. It's just that knowing your past, it's hard not to think. That's not fair at all. It kind of is if he's had a tricky past. And I'm asking you to trust me. Watch him say this and he still cheated all along. I feel like they wouldn't drag out this storyline as much as they have if he hadn't cheated. Sometimes a leap of faith is the only move you can make. Or a leap into Marco's arms. Oh, so he can be like, you drove here without me? Oh, oh, he can walk fine. Okay, you had a better shot with Marco and I knew you wouldn't kick me off the team, so I did it for you. You mad? No, because she's a more understanding friend than you've ever been. I think he went to a concert. I guess he left his phone here. Any idea who he might have gone with? Chloe. I think he went with Chloe. Okay, uh, thanks. This is not good. So I'm using every free hour I have. Practicing into the night for this competition that you asked me to help you with, just so I could screw things up for you? That is very true, he has a point. I don't think that's his angle. No. And we stand, Marco. You have to trust me. Oh, she's been told that I mean, before. I've been giving you so much shit. Oh, she swore. Is this a 12 anymore? <laughs> See, they genuinely get along. Oh, they're having a moment. Do you think you and Noah were meant to be together? No. Straight up, no. I always thought we were. No. Like, now. No. Yeah, it's just a no now. <laughs> You've got Marco right there. Come on. Like, what are you doing? Trying. What is this film so long for? We are only halfway in. And there's gonna be a third one? Why? What can they possibly need a third one for? They don't even need this one. Marco is the way, he's the path, he's the next direction. Oh, he just whips out his guitar? Where did he have that from? See, where, when did he get his guitar? They were just at the theme parky thing, the carnival. 
Oh, she's like, wow, that song was everything. You're a songwriter. Mm hmm, mm hmm. No? If she asks him where he was and he doesn't say he was at the concert, then lies. He's definitely cheating. Yeah, it was nice. We saw this pretty great band. Oh, okay. He did say it was a concert. He just didn't say who he was. He's gonna lie. Yeah. Oh, lies. He's cheating, man. Yeah, this is trash. He is trash. She needs someone new. Marco, please. So you're in now? I don't know. I don't know what I am. I just... Aww. I like him. I don't know. He's kind of adorable. He is. He's She's sweet. right. Oh, just get together. Go on. And those dimples, definitely. They kind of look similar though. Are they Ghostbusters? That's quite a cool outfit. Where's Rachel though? Oh, and Marco's probably gonna show up. Oh, Rachel's in the car. Oh, she came. I forgot to tell her way to make her feel left out. Do those people's arms get tired? Surely they get very tired. What if you dropped a candle on yourself? How do they get their hand back in the hole without burning them? Oh, Marco's performing again. We love a musician. Oh, he's so much better than Noah. Jesus Christ, it hurts my soul. I'm serious though, she should just break up with Noah and be with Marco. Oh, are we getting into a dangerous area here? Oh, this film just annoys me so much though because they're not going to end up together, which is stupid. Break up with Noah, man. Come on, please put me out of my misery. Like, who really likes Noah? Please someone show me one person who does who would choose noah over marco you can't if you say you can get help so i was thinking oh, ollie maybe and him are gonna go out you and i could... <gasps> hey dude hey, oh they dude. interrupted the moment oh they're gonna do like a best friend dance again and leave rachel out but what best friends have a planned out dance routine for specific songs this has never happened in real life Oh, do they miss each other? They do, because they're besties. Oh, Chloe and Noah. No, no, I'm not here for that. I kind of feel sorry for Elle. Both the brothers are just ditching her. Yet Marco is really the only one she has left. Oh, what's going on with Noah and Chloe? A bit too close for comfort there. Thank you very much. All the dads catching on again like before. Wait, did they use this song last time? This film is structured so similarly, similarly? It's structured so similarly to the last one, but it's just more boring. Like it's not entertaining like the last one was. The earring. He's lying to you this whole time and who knew it we all did? Just let go. She's letting go of Noah. Oh, he's taken back at the end, which I'm going to be mad about. Oh my god, no. What's with this, like, her being green screened over that? Jesus Christ, this is very dramatic. Feels like a fan edit. See, look how happy she is of Marco. Never seen her this happy of Noah before. Them not being together is a bunch of bullshit. I'm sorry, it just is. Ooh. 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 Damn. Hope they had some mints. She was untied. Oh, actually, is this time? No, it's just a joke. Okay. It'd be funny though if it was untied and she fell over. That's what they do in the first one. Can we get some of that cheesiness back from the first one, please? This one's taking itself too seriously. She's her moonshot. She's his moonshot. Jesus. There's still 40 minutes left and I really can't be asked. Oh, this is intense, man. Jesus Christ. My lord, this is serious. The ground is shaking. The fire reminds me of Camp Rock, the final jam. Iconic. I'd rather watch that right now. Does he not know that Elle's going to Harvard? What the hell? Oh, he doesn't know Elle's going to Harvard because he's going to throw a little hissy fit over the fact that, like, rule number 21, they had to go to the same school as their besties. Which is stupid. Just have fun. Like, move on. You guys can still text. She took his hand. Rightfully so. No, it is trash. 
Oh no, I was watching. He's there. I didn't know he was there. Watch them two have a moment because I don't think she knows he's there either. Damn. Oh, he's watching online. Yay. Oh, look at those tricks, man. Oh my god, the full. Oh, the splits. Lucky she didn't rip her pants this time. Oh, look, see, the judges are like, wow, never seen this before. If Marco's not going to stick around, can they at least be like dance buddies? Oh, their dance is long. Look at this. I wonder how long it took them to actually learn this, though. He's like, can't believe she's going Harvard and didn't tell me. God. Don't, don't have a moment right now because no is there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh, oh no. Oh, that's not good. Oh no. And no. Oh no. Uh. She's going to realise that Noah's out in the audience now. <laughs> Why does it take us like an hour and a half to get to the most interesting part of the film? Can't deal with this right now. So we're just going to ignore what's happening between us? Yeah, a connection and chemistry that Noah and Elle don't have. They're going to leave Marco in the dust. Oh. The taste, it's not here. Hopefully Thanksgiving dinner at the Flynn's would take care of both problems. Oh, this is gonna be an awkward dinner. See, the common denominator here is the brothers being the issue. Why are you mad? Uh, I don't know, maybe the answer is in here. My god, Lee, move on. Oh, be happy for her that she's applying to Harvard. You've already grown, had some distance. Get over the rules. Oh, I can't stand how immature he is. <gasps> He brought Chloe back? So are you. That is low though. They better explain the earring and not have him gaslight her. Why are you acting like I'm the one that did something wrong? Noah. You had Chloe's earring under your bed, so please explain that to all of us here. Oh, the dad's just giving like a death glare at Noah. I found Chloe's earring. Oh, yes, bring it up. Where did you find it? Under Noah's bed. Say it. Say it. Under Noah's bed. Yes. Are we gonna explain it in some really stupid way? You no, know, it kind of looked to me like he'd already rearranged your life. Oh, why is he turning this on her? Trash. Oh, such trash. Where are you going? To fix something that's actually worth saving. Her and Marco. Her and Marco, please. That's all I'm asking for. Out of this really long, boring film. I was just. Oh. Her and Rachel. Not what I was asking for, but I mean, sure. I crashed at your place after getting into a fight with Jason, and the earring must have just fallen off then. Why? But it just doesn't sound believable, and I kind of wish he cheated because it just sounds so stupid. I'm still not here for this storyline. Like, it's so stupid. Realistically, if there's an earring under the bed, he's probably cheated. How is there still half an hour? <laughs> Like what? Why is it so long? And there's gonna be a third one. My God, I'm just gonna jump off my balcony. Rule number five. <laughs> Not the rule. What did you say? I said congratulations. Oh, drama, drama, llama. Oh no. Oh. Oh, he's like ready to fight because that's so healthy. Wow, he is control. Amazing. There's no way those two didn't do anything i still think she should just end up with marco superior option like noah is just trash i will say that a million times not gonna lie as weird as you but guy was i kind of missed him this film oh wait yeah but guy is there he just had an emo makeover is he gonna cry i think he is stupid and a douche and trash. It's very arrogant. Has anger issues. Can tend to be controlling. Ollie can't do it because he wants the other guy. <gasps> He's gonna admit it. He's gonna look for him. Oh, they really do look similar though. Like they could be cousins. Do you have a ticket? Their storyline was better than the whole movie. Toppin is me. Yay, finally. The only characters I care about. I don't even know both of their names. 
Noah this time is going to be there. It's coming full circle. That's Noah. It's Marco. Can't deny there's something real between us. There is something real. More real than what's between you and Noah. We felt something. I felt something. I know it. I do know it. Don't be afraid of how you feel. She shouldn't be. She should be afraid of Noah. I know. He's not the one. He could be. You know who's not the one? Noah. Ah, uh, no, they just had to put away the one good character this film had and treat him like trash. And now she's going to end up with Noah. No one cares about Noah. Normally the film's just supposed to want the two main leads to get back together. I do not want the two main leads to get back together. I want her to get together with Marco. Oh my god, this is a mistake. This is a big mistake. Maybe he just hasn't left this time. Like, he didn't get on the plane. I don't think he's getting on the plane. Oh, that's not Noah. What are you doing here? She's gonna be like, Noah left. You've got to believe me, there is nothing going on between Noah and me. You can see why Elle's mind went where it did, though. He just wanted me there so that we could become friends. He didn't come across that way. He should communicate this stuff. And I was like, where are you? Is that him? <laughs> yeah. What did he say? He's like at the kissing booth. <laughs> He's at the kissing booth. Oh, we're meeting here again. Maybe he proposes and then the next film's their wedding. When I started this school year, I was pretty lonely. I told you he was lonely. I thought so. I could tell. Do you love him? I do. Husband him up, please. Jesus Christ, you don't need Noah. Please try to remember what I'm about to say. If it doesn't involve Margo, I don't think I can remember. I'm sorry. It's you, Noah. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, the poor woman. What's happened to her? You know, just to introduce some great character who has the potential to be the new main male lead and then just toss him her way. He's no seconds. He's the whole mill. Jesus Christ. This could not end sooner, I swear to God. Who's Rochelle Evans? Is that Elle's new name? Is she really gonna tear up over the college? I said I didn't think she really would. She's read too many to get emotional. She's probably only getting emotional because it's like the 800th one she's had to read. Life's a bitch. And so am I. Are they not gonna tell us what uni she got into? We're gonna have to figure it out like in the next film. Cause I'm not reading the books for this. Watch Marco be going to Harvard too. Can we? Give me some hope, please. I'm going to Harvard. I, uh, I got waitlisted. She got waitlisted? I'm sorry, Rochelle. Rochelle? Oh my God, that's her actual name. I'm so stupid. It only just clicked. L is short for Rochelle. Oh my Jesus Christ. Wow. I'm next level thick. Yes, she is. He said she's worth it. Let's just ah! that right now. <laughs> Are they gonna, they gonna actually, I still have hope for Marco and Elle. Oh my god, he's gonna be in the next film. That's the only reason that I'll watch the next film. She's just grabbing his man boobs, okay. But there's hope, okay, that's the only reason I'll watch the next film is because of Marco and Elle. No, we don't want to get in an accident. And a long way from knowing everything. I know everything, Marco is the one. Please end here, they're driving off into the sunset again, it has to... It's not ending here. Has she opened the letter? She didn't open the letters. She got accepted. She lied. She's been accepted into both. She lied. So what does this mean? She's gonna go Harvard. Marco's gonna be in Harvard. Oh, I would watch the bloopers this time, but I do need to pee real bad. That film was kind of boring. At least the first one was entertaining, even if it was just bad. This one's just bad. Like, it's boring and bad. First one, entertaining and bad. Second one, boring and bad. Because they took themselves too seriously. They didn't make fun of themselves in it. Also, they made a big mistake with the whole Marco situation there. They really should have just had Elle and Marco end up together. But I think the third film might lead to them being together. Because he just said she's worth it. And I think Elle's gonna go to Harvard Uni 
Mark is also going to be there. So is Noah. And then, bam, love triangle, dilemma, all that jazz. I just want Mark and Elle to end up together because they had so much more chemistry than Noah and Elle ever have had. Which movie did you prefer, the first or second? If you say the second, get help. That film drained my will to live, which was already very low at the beginning of this film. Also, I definitely hate myself after this film because I'm not getting those two hours back, ever. So, um, yeah, but um, okay, we're gonna leave it there. I really need to pee. Thanks for watching. Um, I'm tired of hearing the sound of my voice and I'm sure you're tired of hearing the sound of my voice. I'm very sweaty, so we're just gonna leave it there. If you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe. It means the world to me. And have a nice rest of your day, so adios. Finally!